Hello, I'm Charlene Rucker, Customer Service Manager for Pandaya Press. Today I'm going to walk you through our Real Science Odyssey series, but first I want to introduce you to Pandaya Press. For 16 years, over 500,000 homeschool and charter school parents, along with private schools, have trusted Pandaya Press to offer high-quality, academically rigorous, secular materials to prepare their children for college and beyond. We specialize in history and science courses for elementary through high school. Before I start telling you about Real Science Odyssey, I'd like to reassure you that you can teach sophisticated and complex scientific concepts to your child, whatever their age, even if you don't have a scientific background. Laying down a solid scientific foundation that helps them understand the world around them is easier than you think with our courses. This is why we call our series Real Science Odyssey. Real science requires an introduction to scientific theory and scientific vocabulary. Real science pairs the theory with labs and activities, like the 3D cell model you see here, that solidify a student's understanding of the theory. What makes Real Science Odyssey special is that students do science just like a scientist, with labs and activities that have them carefully observing scientific phenomena, testing hypotheses, reporting on their findings, and thinking about what they've learned. All of these skills are transferable and can serve them in many other subjects. So here is our Real Science Odyssey series. Through level one, your first through fourth grader can learn about life, astronomy, earth and environment. Chemistry is for grades two to five and physics is for grades three to six. Biology two and astronomy two are for grades six to 10. The Stargazer's Notebook can be added to Astronomy 2 to make it a full year course, or you can use the Stargazer's Notebook as a standalone study for the night sky. The age range for it is 10 to 100. The whole family can get involved in stargazing. You may be asking, why such a range of grades? All of our courses span several grades, so you can have the option of teaching multiple students. Courses have suggested additional reading, research, and videos to make them more challenging for students at the upper end of the grade range. Now I'm going to tell you about the real in Real Science Odyssey. The real in Real Science Odyssey stands for read, explore, absorb, and learn. These are the four things your student will do throughout any Real Science Odyssey course. You can also think about it this way. Your student will be a real scientist all year. At the beginning of each chapter or unit, they'll read about scientific concepts and theories pertaining to the subject at hand. Real Science Odyssey courses contain lessons that you read to or with your child in Level 1, or the child reads independently in Level 2. Level 1 courses have a short lesson, while Level 2 courses have a much more involved lesson. These lessons are rich in scientific vocabulary and complex scientific concepts presented in an age-appropriate way. We believe the best way to learn science is by doing science. And by learn, I mean to really understand, not just memorize. Doing science means your child takes the concepts you're introducing to them in the lesson and applies those concepts in a meaningful way. This is where they will practice being scientists and where they take ownership of the information they learned in the lesson. In this lab example from Astronomy 1, students take what they learned from the Traveling Through the Asteroid Belt lesson and they learn how a frost line forms using Jell-O. There's an introduction for you to read aloud, so you don't have to know or remember there's a place in the asteroid belt called the frost line and how it relates to the size of the planets. You also get a materials list and detailed instructions on how to complete the lab. Most labs have a lab sheet where your student will record their observations. And in this case, they can eat their experiment when they're done. Here's another example, this time from Biology 2. In this lab, students construct a 3D scientific model of an animal cell. In the lesson they just read, called The Inside Story, they've learned about all the parts of animal and plant cells, the organelles, and how they function. In this lab, they construct organelles out of modeling clay and then place those organelles into plaster of Paris to create a cross-section of a cell. Why do this? Cells are three-dimensional and so are their organelles. That might seem obvious to you, however, a study was conducted to determine if students knew this, and most did not, because every cell they had ever viewed looked flat. So most students thought cells were two-dimensional. By physically making and labeling the organelles, 
they get to see the shapes and relative sizes in three dimensions. This lab is Instagram worthy. Parents love to post their students' completed cells. Real Science Odyssey helps your child absorb complex concepts through different modes of learning. All our courses offer additional books to read, websites to visit, and videos to watch. Level 2 courses, both Astronomy and Biology 2, also include in each chapter what we call the Famous Science Series. Students research several questions on their own. The information they need is not found in the course material, so they're expected to use internet research to answer the questions. The topics are relevant to the week's lesson. So what did your child learn at the end of each lesson? In Real Science Odyssey Level 1 courses, learning is demonstrated and evaluated through the labs. Some lessons also include a conclusion section you can use to turn statements into questions or to just get your student talking about what they learned, making connections and thinking more about the topic. An answer key is provided in each lesson so you can check your student's work. Level 2 courses have short quizzes called Show What You Know. These help you and your student determine if they've learned the material covered that week. Chapters are organized into units, so your student can also take a unit test to see how well they've retained all the information in that unit. This might be a good time to mention that Level 2 courses have a separate teacher guide. These guides have suggested weekly schedules, learning goals, extracurricular resources, math concepts you may need to review, lesson reviews, and test answer keys. If you want to see Real Science Odyssey in action, Check out our YouTube channel and watch How to Take Science from Ho-Hum to Wow. You'll meet Blair Lee, the primary author of the Real Science Odyssey series. She shows you how to teach complex and abstract scientific ideas in a way that is both accessible and enjoyable for kids, whether you've got a strong science background or you feel intimidated about teaching science. Blair uses a chapter from Real Science Odyssey Chemistry 1 to demonstrate how hands-on labs allow children to understand sophisticated scientific principles and theories through auditory, visual, and tactile experiments and activities. You'll discover why this is the best way to tap into a child's natural way of learning. Before we end, I want to let you know about our Try Before You Buy program. We offer generous samples of every publication so you can be sure you're choosing the right fit for your family. Just visit our website at pandiapress.com and click on Try Before You Buy in the top menu. You can try as many of our courses as you'd like for absolutely free. Also, be sure to check out our free pandemic unit study full of history, science, and language arts activities. You can download it directly from our website. Be sure to follow us on social media. We have a private Facebook group specifically for our parents that are working through Real Science Odyssey courses with their students. Find it on our main Pandaya Press Facebook page. Thank you so much for taking the time to learn about Pandaya Press and Real Science Odyssey.